you see a lot of stuff and you've been there 20 years, which is pretty unusual for the financial services industry. So whether it's your partnerships, your alt data, uh, some of your workflows, what, what are you seeing as the research effort today? Yeah, thank you. That's a great question. And thanks for, for having me here. Um, so I'm Richard Lichtenstein. Uh, as Brian mentioned, I've been here 20 years at Bain. Uh, I'm our chief data officer for our private equity business. And uh, I co-lead our work around Gen AI and private equity. And so I've probably worked directly with about 40 funds, talked to probably well over 100, and uh, probably done about 70 projects on Gen AI in the last couple of years. Some of it helping funds think about how to make their own businesses more efficient. Some of it thinking about, look, a lot of it is diligence. So they're looking at a new business and trying to figure out how is Gen AI going to affect that business and you know, good ways or bad ways. And then some of it is companies they already own. So which companies are at risk or have opportunities and how do they go after those and then working with the companies directly. I spent a lot of time on this. I also have a big team of people at Bain, over 100. And part of what they do is develop new tools and, and things. And we've been building a lot with Gen AI. And that's been exciting. And obviously, we've partnered with many people, including, you know, including AlphaSense and others, um, to help create tools that our teams can, can get value from. I mean, I think the big trend that I'm seeing when I talk to the customer, to their customers, really, to, to private equity funds, is they have they know they're sitting on a lot of data, right? I mean, they know they've looked at a lot of deals, they own a lot of companies, they, they have it all, and they don't know where any of it is. I mean, it's sitting on people's hard drives, it's sitting all over the place, they have no clue. And so their number one need, if you ask them, is we just want a knowledge management system. We want something where we can search for something and find it. Um, and then obviously, if it was able to plug into other sources too, right, to third party sources, you know, that's, if that's a real bonus, right, then it's even better. But that, that need for just even basic knowledge management as a starting point is, is sort of the foundational layer that every fund is looking for.